Good day, everybody. Hello. Welcome to Vlogmas Vlog 3. And you've probably noticed, or you, or you may have not noticed, but we're not at home here. We're actually in London for one night, two days, one night. And uh, we thought we'd kind of treat ourselves to somewhere a little bit before the Christmas uh, festivities start, you know, like actually on Christmas Day, we thought we'd get some London in us. Yeah, we're going to do a timestamp on this because we do have a tier review this week, probably yes. when this video comes out. Yeah. So we don't know where everything all stands, but... Um, it's, de it's December the 14th, <laughs> Monday, December the 14th. I thought for a minute there, I was like, what day? What day is it today? Yeah, but it's December the 14th. Uh, the review meant to be in the UK for London is on the 16th of December, so we will be home by the time that it's been reviewed, just in case mm -hmm. things change. So just... Just to let you all no. be aware yeah. of, you know, if, if anything happens and stuff, we're all, you know... We're all safe. We're all safe, we're all well, and we're all looking after each other and being aware exactly. of our surroundings. Exactly. So. Uh, we're at the Apex Hotel on Fleet Street. We actually stayed in this hotel, like... Five years ago, we did it, actually vlog this. It was actually our very first vlog that we ever did. Was it? Yeah. Oh. It was London Comic Con. It was. And we went to see uh, Stan Lee and all them. It was, so yeah. So it was our very first vlog that we did. So if you remember that. Well, we'll, we'll see if it's still there and it's one not them, being like copyrighted or anything like that. So we'll, we'll put it think, down below if yeah. we can find it. I think one of them may have been taken because of the copyright music, but yeah. I think there isn't day two, but... Yeah, we'll see if we can link it in the description so you can check it out. But yeah, we're here for one night. We're going to head over into London, but we thought we'd do you a little mini room tour. I've just noticed Never my been. hair is all over the place. But let's do a little mini room tour, it's shall fine. we? It's rainy outside. It is. It's fine. fine. As you come here, this is our main door from the inside. Mirror, hello me. The bathroom. And before you say, this is what's behind the bathroom door. We have a separate bath. Big walk-in shower with the door. Very fancy. It's huge. Absolutely massive. All rooms have been given anti uh, bacterial wipes, all the good stuff that's my toothbrush, and all that good jazz, extra water for glasses, and a bin. And what's the next bit? The big bed. The big bed. Got a big bed. This. this is huge. The one I actually booked this hotel, we were booked a uh, standard double, I think it was, or they call it as a deluxe double. And they were actually, for an extra £12, you can go for the superior, so I went for the superior. And it's a, it was a bigger room. There's no real difference in the standard of it. It was just, a, I think it was like five meters squared bigger. Or I mean, if you want to see a really bigger, bigger room, just check out our old vlog. Yes, that was Because huge. we had a freestanding bath and everything. We did. Big comfy bed here. Lots of pillows, so Steph will be happy. One of two bathrobes, but they want to just show one. The other one's in the cupboard. Sofa, which can be made as a sofa bed. Espresso machine. Some, um, what do you call it again, Steph? When it's tap water in a bottle. Coronation pop. That's the one. Coronation pop. Does anyone pop. else call it coronation pop? Like my parents used to like to stop us encouraging drinking too many fizzy drinks. She, they used to say, oh, would you like some coronation pop? And because like we thought, oh, pop, yeah. And we found out it's just hot water. <laughs> you got the dress table, makeup table. You've got mirror. So if you want to put your, do your makeup. Telly here. Looks like it's a sky telly because it's got a sky box. Our view. This is our view of the car park. And this is our lovely room that we're staying in for the night. We're super excited. And party at a time, eh? So like if we were having a party like now, like, Way! and then this, this opens and then there's already a party in there and you'd be like, oh, I can't join that party. I wish, were, I wish they were in our party though. No one's having a party in here. No parties no in here. No parties in here. <laughs> dun, dun. <laughs> also just wanted to mention, our friends made us these Christmas masks. Which are like Disney inspired. They're great. They're amazing. That Christmas tree, that is beautiful. It's like a square reef. It's different, isn't it, than a circle reef? Very fancy. A fire pit. Fireplace, yeah. Um, Love it. Let's go right into London, shall we? Yeah. And also, if you haven't seen our old vlog, He's the same here. elephant was here. The same elephant was here from our first ever vlog that we did. At, um, London Film Comic Con. We did wonder if he was still going to be here. That is true. But yeah. Yeah, he's here. We were doing some research around here. Yep. And we think it's this street here, but it says here, the Sunday Post, the People's Friend, People's Journal. This is, isn't this like the newspaper sort of street as well? Like where most people started. Yeah, it's where all the old newspaper, newspaper offices used to be. Yeah. But also, this is where Mrs. Lovett's pie shop was in Fleet Street. If you so. don't know what that is, that's from obviously Sweeney Todd. I think it's down here in this road. We're not sure it might be further a bit down, but there is a pub 
that has a, a sign. that actually sells pies. Pies. Not Which, real human pies. Not human pies. Although I think they do vegan pies as well. <laughs> okay. So we actually found the area. Um, it's in you, between the... In between these buildings here, there's a shop just here, which I'll show you. This building just here, which was actually next to that, the the People's Post and the Sunday Post. So is this shop here, which used to be the old Sweeney Todd Harbour's, which is pretty awesome. Now it's an art place. So we are here at South Bank. One it's of our favourite places when the food markets do return. I know, it looks so weird. Normally there's food markets all the way there. And it's one of our favourite places to come every time we come here. I think it's Christmas so good. time as well is like really Busy. good. Yeah. Obviously it's cancelled, but apparently the lights are on and everything. Yeah. Yeah, so you can just see there's some lights on the trees just over there, which is what they're doing this year. Normally there's like stalls all the way dotted across underneath the bridge, but obviously because of what's happening right now, you can't do it. But it's a shame really. But we're going to head there. We've seen a few stores over there, so we may pop over there and see Let's what we've got. Go and have got. a look at the eye. Oh, it looks eye. like it's moving. Oh yeah, it is. Very slowly, yeah. Even though the market's not open, there's still a possibility to get mulled wine, spice cider and some hot whiskey. I've been keeping my eyes on you. It's an Uber boat. Uber. Uber. It's such an Uber. How do you order that? Did you get your own boat to yourself, or was it, you or was it I shared? Need... <laughs> I need to get to this place quick. <laughs> You've been taking notice, that much is clear. We're just walking down uh, Piccadilly Circus area going to Fortune and Mason. Thought we go check it out for Christmas. You've got to do it. We've got to do it. We love <laughs> Fortune and Mason. It's one of our favourite places. I don't know why, but it always screams out Christmas when I ever go there. I don't I know kinda why. I prefer it over Harrods or... Do you know? Yeah. Over Harrods? I'm sorry. Said it. Bougie. <laughs> Bouge. Here we are. We're at Fortune and Mason. Yeah, and all the windows are, are advent calendar, so the days are all lit up. Of course they Never. Are. Like Love that. it. So we're going to go in, enjoy right. a bit of Christmassy cheer. How gorgeous this is, man. How amazing is this decoration of so Christmas? Lovely. So good, all these garlands and wreaths. How awesome is this? It's got an ice cream parlor, they don't know that. Ooh, look at all the big containers of all the Christmassy stuff you can buy. This, this is like a tea section here at Fort Animation. There's a section here you can make your own tea. Mm. So you're going to be really Christmas, like a really personal gift for yeah. someone. If, you you, get if, if someone loves tea, do it. You come here because they've got so much tea here, it's ridiculous. These are biscuits, obviously. Yeah, these are biscuits to dunk your tea in. Also, teacups of wings. Look at this. Gin and tonic tea, vanilla nougat tea, Sunday tea, like ice cream Sunday tea. Mm. You've got like lemon curd, mint humbug, summer cocktail, chocolate violet, bloody Mary. You, you really want to go for proper bouge. Alternation hampers. They are like the best things ever. You like some British honeycomb stuff. Yeah. It weighs a ton, doesn't it? It also costs a ton. How much does it cost? Nice. Yeah, we're not going to buy it. Don't you think that the holiday should be all about love? How amazing they are. I always try and think how long these have been here for. I think they've been here for a very, very long time. Oh, yeah. Like, how long have these lights been here for? It's a bar bus. A bar bus? I'll have a drink. With a reasonable... Why am I never finding these things? I always find them down Regent Street and go, What is this? I want to go on a bar bus. <laughs> I don't want a bar bus. Can we join and have a couple of cocktails, please? We'll have a substantial meal on it. Exactly.
in my days. A home slice before home. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Wagyu beef pizza from Home Slice. <laughs> this this vlog's just all about food. The double dose will be happy with us, you know. They would be, yeah. They would be over the moon with our choices.